Okay, so I did a clean install of Windows and I found that there was a really slow upload speed when I connected to Ethernet, but it's completely fine if I use Wi Fi. So I was getting like 200 kilobits on Ethernet, but on Wi Fi, I was getting like 58 megs. So I looked it up and apparently it's because uh, one, the newer Windows version has some kind of problem with their the killer control center. And Specifically, it's having problems with this advanced stream detect feature, which is basically a load balancing feature that Killer developed that it doesn't work at all. One of the things that Killer provides right here is an uninstaller tool that uninstalls all the Killer software from your computer. So this is super useful. So this is the first thing you're going to download. And the second thing you're going to download is uh, the drivers, but you're not going to download um, the control center, because if you download that, it's going to install all these useless shit on your computer. So what you want to do is go into others and download the INF package. I've already downloaded the INF package and the installer. So once you have these two downloaded, you'll run the killer software uninstaller and you're going to press scan for install killer software. Now in my case, because I've already done this, so I have a very clean install where it finds nothing. But in your case, you're probably going to find a lot of uh, random stuff like uh, killer filter and, and some other very random things that you didn't even know you had installed. So then what you're going to do is disconnect from your internet, like unplug your ethernet cable and disconnect it from Wi-Fi. And then you're going to press remove killer software. And it's going to take a while. And when it's done, it'll tell you that restart is required. So then you re restart your computer. And once you restarted your computer, you just extract the INF package that you have downloaded and you're going to extract whatever's inside. And then you're going to go into device manager, uh, go into your network adapter, just choose your killer adapter, press update driver, browse my computer for driver. And then you're just going to take this pass, put it in here, and you make sure you check include subfolder. Press next. Now, obviously, I've already done this, or it's already installed the best driver. And then after that, you should have your normal upload speeds back. So, so before I was getting upload speeds of like 200 kilobits per second, and then after I installed everything and reinstalled just the drivers, now I'm getting like. 80 megabits per second so obviously huge improvement so after all the uninstalling and reinstalling windows update will see that you don't have these extension and software components anymore and they'll try to reinstall them on in the update but these components and extensions are what caused the problem in the first place so we don't want it to install this you don't want to uninstall and reinstall everything like every day or something like that so what Windows have on the support page is this, um, I guess, a temporary solution where you can download this file. And it's uh, basically a troubleshooter that lets you hide um, updates. So, and then run the troubleshooter. It'll look for all the updates that is pending. And then you're going to select hide updates. And then you check both of these that says Rivet Networks, which is basically killer. You're going to press next. And then I'll say fixed. So once you've hidden those updates um, and restarted your computer, you shouldn't see those updates anymore. And Windows won't try to install it until you uh, rerun this show or hide updates program and go into the show hidden updates and re-enable these updates. So yeah, that's basically how you remove all the useless stuff from killer network and just install drivers to get the best performance.